Hey everyone, Farmington, New Mexico Mayor Nate Duckett here with Randy West, our new director of the Farmington Civic Center. Randy, I wanted to tell everybody some of the exciting shows we have happening in November. Break it down for us. Absolutely. On November 8th, we have Ronnie Cox, the movie star, is coming here to show the first film he appeared in, which is Deliverance, and he's going to talk about what it's like to shoot a movie like that on location. Right now, New Mexico is becoming a very hot spot for film and television work, so if you want to get a little insight into what it's like to shoot a movie on location, come share that night with Ronnie Cox as he shows his movie Deliverance here at the Civic Center. And then on the 9th, He's bringing his whole band to town, and they're going to perform in the in the theater uh, an evening of it, it's kind of folk rock and uh, folk um, country music, and they they play internationally all over the world. And just last week, he was inducted into the New Mexico Hall of Fame for musicians. So the next week, he's coming here to share his style of music with us here in Farmington. And then on the 15th, we have the Blue Note Records 80th birthday celebration. It basically is three substantial artists out of the Chicago jazz scene, uh, Candace Springs, the James Carter Organ Trio, and James Francis. All three of these people headline their own concerts, but they're coming here on that one night to all three be in the same concert. And after the concert, there's a reception, an afterglow, being sponsored here by the San Juan Jazz Society. So it's a great chance to come meet people who are really into jazz or explore jazz for the first time here in Farmington. Randy, you sound like uh, three great nights of entertainment right here at the Farmington Civic Center. There's a lot more happening here at the Farmington Civic Center that we want to make you aware of. Stay tuned for the uh, November 18th episode of The Mayor's Table. We'll have a full array and discuss the future of our new reinvigorated entertainment offerings right here in the city of Farmington.